with uh, not so scary <laughs> stuff, but funny stuff. She's been described as mini pearl with a migraine. We welcome the <laughs> queen of southern sass, comedian Etta May. She is right here, and she got here just as we were reading the story about the uh, uh, oh, bad, the bad gas. gas. <laughs> I, the bad gas, and and you you said it so straight faced. They have bad gas. It's like, well, my husband has bad gas, and it's not on the news. My husband has such bad gas, we call it fracking. Oh, oh okay. man. Ouch. Yikes. I but think you know, a lot of us ladies can relate to that, right? Well, they'll get to the bottom of that problem. Oh, my uh, God. Now, I, we couldn't help but notice, though, what a good mood you were in. I you am. I'm that. so happy. You know what? Yeah, I, I, I realized... I've got an incredible husband. I'm a middle-aged, sexy woman. I've got four incredible kids <laughs> and Prozac that makes all that stuff feel true. There you go, yes. a little white pill. I was on the happy pill. <laughs> you like this Mama's time of year? Mama's little helper. Do you like oh, this time of year? Oh, I love this time of year. Yeah. You know mainly why? Shorts don't hang on me right. They always <laughs> ride up on me, get sticky. Yeah, you know, <laughs> you know, and I, uh, I, I have to walk around, and about every third step, I have to go, you know, to get the shorts to drop. It's terrible. I'm always, I, you know what? Uh, and, and shorts don't hang on me right, and I'm so glad corduroy went out of style. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, because my thighs rub together. You know, I, I sound like two cheese graters walking down the. Walking down the little hallway. Well, you know, we'll all be indoors now more, you know, with it being uh, cooler and all that. But you're on Facebook now, right? I'm on yeah. Facebook. Yeah. Well, I'm on Facebook and my kids are doing it for me. My, Do you my, ever worry about what they're going to post? Oh, no, because I know the right one to help me. Um, <laughs> <laughs> my 13-year-old um, uh, Miller is, is helping me with the Facebook. And, but, oh, my God, this technology has gotten out of control. I got my mm -hmm. daughter a cell phone. Uh, all the kids have cell phones. Uh, but my daughter texts so much that uh, the other day we were having dinner, and my cell phone went off. We were about to eat. My cell phone goes off. I go back to the back of the trailer. And I look at my cell phone, and my daughter from the kitchen has asked me to pack, pass her the macaroni and cheese. Oh, what'd you do? I got back to the table. I sent her a picture of the macaroni and cheese with subtitle, Bon Appetit. <laughs> but, you know, I'm a bad speller, so Surrey helped me out on that, and it kind of turned out to be bite me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it just happened that way, did it? Uh -huh. All right, you're going to be out at the Comedy Off-Broadway for two big weekends. Two big weeks, and next weekend I've got a, a friend of mine out of Nashville, uh, Dan Whitehurst, who is a, an ex-cop. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So he'll be um, with you? Yeah, yeah oh, he's a very funny guy, very funny guy. But um, come on out. I love this time of year because I don't have to do yard work, <laughs> nothing. I can eat chili. Well, it is a fun time of year. It and you fun. get, you know, you'll get everybody kind of lighthearted. We head toward the holiday season, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. I'm and not too sure that wasn't my daughter. <laughs> oh, the one that was, yeah. The exorcist. Yeah. That was that scary, was freaky though. freaky thing. <laughs> <laughs> it's Anna Mae, everybody. She's at Comedy Off Broadway this weekend and next, actually starting in the middle of the week, Wednesday and Thursday night shows, as well as Friday and Saturday night. You're going to be working. I'm working, yeah. baby. <laughs> All right. It's a good thing, right? Thanks for being yeah. here. Appreciate yeah, it as you. always. Thank you. We'll